and welcome back to Dr. Andy Adventures. And thank you so much for joining me once again, you guys, on my brand new adventure. Oh, honey, it is a brand new adventure. And I am at Imbubu Lodge, which is in Richards Bay. I am here for our church conference. I am super excited about that. It's going to be absolutely amazing. Absolutely epic. Our conferences are usually just incredible. Um, so I'm going to be here for the next three days. And um, I'll be here for the next two nights at Imbubu Lodge. That's where I'm booked. I just decided that I wanted to book something different. You know, I didn't want to book a hotel or anything like that. Um, there's not much options in Richards Bay for accommodation anyways. I mean, there is, but there's not much great or different places um, for accommodation. But um, I found this place which looks, which, which are cabins uh, in Google Lodge. Is this, is there's a bunch of cabins. It looks like cabins for like camping cabins vibes. So um, yeah, so I found it online and I just decided to put there and so that I can check it out. Um, so I have entered the property. They told me that um, on that end, there is a restaurant there for breakfast usually. And also I am situated all the way on the other side of the property and it's quite a drive i'm not gonna lie this property seems quite huge and you just kind of drive in the pathway until you get to your cabin and mine is all the way on the other side of the property and they told me that uh, next to my property there is um actually next to my cabin there is um, another restaurant there as well um so yeah they they, they 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 said that as well so i am excited to check the restaurants out and see what is in store so this is this is the actual cabin and you park right here this is my car and you park right next to your cabin this is actually the pathway towards the cabin there's other cabins close by or nearby these are my neighbors <laughs> and that's the pathway towards this cabin and you can just park right next to your cabin which is quite convenient you know if you leave something in the car you can quickly go come and get it in the car super simple um some cabins have car parks car parts i mean and i don't know i'm not really sure which cabins get car parts and why uh, some don't get car parts but some do and some don't i'm assuming it depends on the room that you booked um if you get a car part or not so yeah let's go inside so when you come inside you come into this kitchenette right here ne? So this is the kitchenette, kitchenette with the sink, the microwave, um, you have a kettle right there and you also have a fridge, a bar fridge. Let me see what's in these cabinets, open the cabinets, okay, so you have your mugs, cups, your glasses in the cabinet. close this door quickly and then all right and then you move into the bathroom and in the bathroom you get the the shower the mirror the sink toilet and all that jazz let's move on and then this is the bedroom so it's a one bedroom um cabin on this side it has like a small nook uh, like a reading nook with a chair and a table and i've already put my stuff on the table <laughs> i've already put my stuff on the table okay um and then there is the phone it actually has the numbers that you can call for reception restaurant housekeeping all of that 
And then um, this way you have the closet, which the closet already has. <clears throat> it has the iron and the ironing board, and it has the safe on top. There you go. bed with the aircon and the TV right across the bed so you can lie on the bed watching TV <laughs> and then it has side tables and there is also this table right here there is this table you can sit do some reading with a hair dryer or you can just do your hair your hair, your makeup, whatever it is that you're supposed to be doing. Um, yeah, so this is the cabin. It's a valid cabin. It's a valid cabin. Um, it's going to be my home over the next two nights. And I am excited to be here and to explore the rest of the property. But also, I'm excited to go to church for this conference. It's going to be super epic and amazing. So stay tuned, okay? Better. morning you guys it is the next morning and i'm heading over to breakfast so i just want to show you the breakfast place yeah i'm already dressed and i'm heading over to the church conference so i'm gonna go and have some breakfast first and then we're gonna go to the conference This restaurant it's quite a cute area there's like a um a little tiny area just over this pathway right here um and there is like a wetland all over here a wetland which it looks nice but i'm actually scared that there might just be a lot of insects and bugs that come up here <laughs> i get it I can just imagine the mosquitoes, the insects, the bugs when you're trying to eat. When you, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but it looks quite nice. I actually like it. So I've ordered uh, my breakfast. You actually have to order an a la carte menu. And then, yeah, I've ordered my breakfast and my coffee. I'm going to have that before I head over to the conference. <laughs> Alright you guys, I am at church at the moment and I'm heading over to church for um, our, our service and I just wanted to let you guys know that I also serve at church at our mobile clinic. We usually during our big conferences have a mobile clinic as well as paramedics on site just so that in case of an any emergencies and also um any minor illnesses we want everybody to be healthy and safe um during our conferences so we do have a, quite a few people who come in quite a few patients who come in to our mobile clinic and um throughout the conferences just for a little bit of minor illnesses and maybe um it's, it's 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 different kinds of illnesses that people have um they could be having gastro they sometimes vomiting diarrhea uh, sore throats chest infections and just uh, usually most of the time it's minor illnesses but um at some times it could be something that needs to be referred to a hospital so that's why we have paramedics on site that actually do help us with transporting um our patients over to um, any health facility that they actually need if it's in case of an emergency so yeah we do have that in place because it's quite a big convention we have huge conferences with thousands of people so um yeah we do have that in place in, in case in case <laughs> yep 
so yeah I'm here and I'm gonna head over inside So I actually went to the restaurant that is right, it's a restaurant bar slash bar that is right next to my cabin. It's actually, it's actually quite beautiful because there's like the sea there, it has sea views. So I like that. And um, it also has these wooden vibes as well, like the cabins and also like the other restaurants that I showed you in the morning. And yeah, I just grabbed some pizza to eat. Um, yeah so i'm gonna eat na uh, some pizza right now and just relax a little bit before going to the evening service so yeah it's actually a cool place and i see it's quite popular as well because there's a lot of cars that i hear and people are literally sitting there and chilling and just having a good time music is playing um they have screens there um football is playing so it's like a bar vibe and people are just chilling there so it looks like a good vibe um and it looks like people come here just to chill there and then they leave as well so it's not only people who are booked inside that actually go to that restaurant it seems like it also people from outside come to the restaurant and just chill there and then leave as well so yeah i think it's a guess it's a cool place to hang out if you are around richards bay and you want somewhere to hang out during the day you can just come as a day person to just chill to just chill there with your people <laughs> at Mvubu Lodge um, I definitely do like the scenery where it's just like sea views I love that vibe yeah oh my gosh I've squished it to one side <laughs> squished it to one side well it looks good except that it's burnt here but other than that okay let's let's do a taste okay. this is the meat team pizza that i ordered i figured i should just order something that I can also eat later. This tastes good. It does taste good. Last day. I'm gonna 
gonna go to church first and then after church it's go home day <coughs> bye bye cabin bye cabin Church is finished, church is done. I'm on the road on my way to Durban right now. And when I tell you that at this toll gate, it is absolutely full. It is just so full. It's so full right now. There's so many people coming from every different direction to their homes, to their houses. Um, I'm just I'm excited to go home, honestly. I just want to rest a while um, and I just want to you know just relax I'm actually on call tomorrow which <laughs> sucks but what else can we do but anyway I just wanted to come here and say thank you so much for hanging out with me and um, just hanging out with me in Richards Bay during our, uh, our conference make sure that you like comment and subscribe and I'll see you on my next adventure